His Morning Crew with Rob, Allison, and Jim. It was a huge moment for the Ham family. They splurged and they bought six tickets to the Charlotte Hornets game. It cost them $360, but it was a Christmas gift for the whole family and they'd never been to a professional NBA basketball game before. So they got into the Spectrum Center. They, the kids were all amped up. They could hear the loudspeakers as they walked in the doors. The game was about to start, but the ticket operator told them the bad news. Their tickets were fake. No. They'd been scammed. So dad, Matt Ham, walked his disappointed crew back to the car and he decided to use this as a teaching moment. Instead of displaying anger, he wanted to demonstrate forgiveness to his family. I think that uh, the lesson we learned is forgiveness, because at the end of the day, it's just money. I prayed for him that he used all that all that money that um, we lost, that he did something good with it, like go buy food or something. The kids were actually praying for the culprit. So I think this lesson definitely sunk in, but the story doesn't end there. It got the attention of the Hornets general manager and he invited the entire Ham family back to Charlotte for another home game as the team's guests. I kind of, as a dad, you're like, yes, you know, like, I wanted to show my boys that forgiveness always wins, mm -hmm. right? That, like, this always works out. You can never go wrong by doing the right thing. Yes, <laughs> forgiveness wins. Isn't that great? <laughs> I love it. I'm so excited for this family. They haven't decided when they're going back to a game, but they're going to have a blast. But way to go Hornets for doing that for that family. They didn't have to, but you said the president did that? Yeah, the general manager. Oh, my gosh. Way to go. Love that. There's really nothing for me to learn in this, though, right? <laughs> Jim. No. Okay. I, yeah. So but, you tuned out. It was all right. Yeah. Either that or Jim is such a forgiving guy. Yeah. Never forgive He's me. always forgiving.